that's all you got. <laughs> We're New Yorkers. We don't lie down for anyone. Okay, but what if it's one of these nut jobs with powers? Like that rhinoceros guy. And my friend, you pray. And you go down fighting. <laughs> that's funny, actually. Alright, what's going on, guys? And welcome back to Spider-Man. This is going to be part 20. In the last episode, we... What did we do? Ah, oh, that's right. We were injected by some sort of uh, hallucinogen by uh, Scorpion. And we were in, like, this mind state for a while, uh, trying to escape and, uh, I guess, cure ourselves, which we eventually ended up doing. And we also used Miles and had to escape Rhino. Stable teams, this is Control. Uh, What's our status in Morningside Heights? Control. Violation of martial law statute 237. Oh, it's just another one of those crime things, but <laughs> anyways, now we are, I think we're about to fight probably both Scorpion and Rhino, so I'm guessing that throughout the rest of this game, you're probably going to be fighting uh, two villains at the same time. Last time we fought Vulture and Electro, and now it looks like we're fighting these two, and then I'm guessing I'm going to be fighting Martin Lee and Doc Ock at the same time. That's what it seems like. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Oh no, I guess we are fighting oh, Rhino by himself. Alright, so what am I supposed to do? Alright, that doesn't work. Oh. Can I drop this on him? Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So it slowed down by itself. I'm thinking... Yeah, I'm thinking I'm supposed to... Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. I think... I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Come on, run. Woo! That didn't work. Ah oh, crud, yeah, I, I timed it wrong. Have to stun Rhino before I can hurt him. What the hell was that? <laughs> Wait, stun him before you can hurt him. I think this is what I'm supposed to do, but it's not letting me do it. Got him! No what? Alright, let me try something else. Uh Got him. There we go. And now I'm supposed to hit him. Yep. Come on. Down. Sit your ass down. Okay. All right. All right. Yep. So now I know what I'm supposed to do. So, yeah, that's why there's all around here. All right. Come here, dude. Let me hit you with this one now. Come on. Got him. Pretend I'm capitalism and smash the state. Next one, next one, next one. That's freaking scary. Stop! Stop! Oh my god. That was horrifying. Alright, come this way, bud. Alright, this is way too easy. There's gotta be something else I gotta do. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Oh, see, that was right. Okay, so it is two villains. Never All right. Send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. All right. Well. What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up. Trying to catch Scorpion. There we go. Yeah, Scorpion's easy as hell. Oh my god. Oh, you kid boy. Alright, uh, let me. 
I think I want to take out Scorpion name, first. Huh? You have a name yet? The scary six? The dirty half dozen? How about the wee murder fight? Use his corpse for a blanket. Hey. Gargan, please. You embarrass yourself. Gargan. Oh, God, I'm in midair. Explain that was nasty. Idiot. Help me. Ah, damn it. All right. Perhaps I should focus on Rhino. Come here, Rhino. Get him, you idiot. Get him. What the hell? Guys, please. I need me to go around. All right, come here, Scorpion. I'm so focused right now. Where'd Scorpion go? There he is. Alright, dude, can you stop being at such a distance? Rhino's getting his suit removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Whoa! I want to hit Scorpion, come on. Oh, he just hit Scorpion! Oh, he took out Scorpion! I think that was an accident. I won't tell anybody. All right. Uh, and leave your skull uncrushed. There is fun in that. Yes. Oh, that was it. That was very you anticlimactic. Know what will do if he finds out you failed. I failed. Yes, you freak show. Ah! Okay, that wouldn't hold Rhino though. The other time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's that wouldn't down. hold Rhino. Just Octavius and Leela. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem though. Devil breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Gotta be honest, that boss fight really didn't hit with me. <laughs> it really didn't. First of all, Scorpion was way too easy. All I literally had to do was just web him and then hit him. Hey, I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Oh, another MJ mission? Yeah, I kind of like the MJ missions though. I'm not gonna lie, they're they're, they're interesting because it's it's different. You know, it's it's sneaking around rather than with Spidey, I can just run around and punch everybody, which is still fun. But but yeah, that boss fight, guys, it, it really didn't hit with me. I'm sorry. Like, it, if it seemed like I really was just kind of uninterested, it's because I was. That boss fight was, I don't know. The Vulture Electro one I thought was more enjoyable than that one. Both on in the very heart of our city, brawling like children. Lethal children, pitching a tantrum of death and destruction. I'm often asked, why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers. Only no, have so you. I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided again. <laughs> I love JJ, man. All right, okay, let me get MJ, into this though. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. That was really fast. I think that boss fight was faster than the uh, Electro Vulture one. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. 
Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Okay. He'll never survive. Next election will on to another MJ mission. I really do wonder how There's much time I have room. left. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. I love how in these games, the character talks out loud. Like, nobody in here can hear her saying that. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Good job, MJ. You can't treat us like animals. If I get sick, I'll sue you into the ground. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Yeah, I was gonna say three sets of people. It's always three. Security room's open. Just oh. need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has finished their. Uh, All right, because none of the people behind me saw that though. Hello. Ooh. I know a few Sable agents who. Oh, do we get to fight? You. MJ, you gonna pause some Taekwondo? Did Peter teach you anything? Oh shit. Copy that control. Five by five. Five by five. Five by five. Hey buddy. Oh, that's cool. I like this thing. We actually get the fight with MJ. Gotta turn him around. Yeah, I remember. Got movement, stand by. Oh Good yeah, boy. you do. Oh, oh I love you this. Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Hey buddy, Next hey buddy. Sable agent. Bah! Mary Jane Watson. Sit down. Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. Oh, it's Sable. And Osborne. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Let's do it. Hey guys, how's it going? Penthouse elevator. Gotta get this into it. the elevator. Norman and Sable. Right on cue. Go, 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 go. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Why are you going to look in the elevator if you're not going to investigate? You know why, guys? Plot armor. That's why. Because nothing can happen to MJ. That's why. Unless she gets caught by like the Ring Goblin or something like that, but doesn't look like he's in this game. Guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Oh, we investigating. Okay, so we got something here. We got something there. We got something there. So we got three things in this general area. Check out the Spider-Man problem. So weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. I can't check it though. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for key padlock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. 
That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Nothing on the back. Okay. Wait, actually, is there anything else on there though? I want to. I want to be thorough. Uh, floor fifty-seven. Is there a date on it though? Seventy-four, sixteen. What about down here? Task quantity description. I don't see a date on here. So say week thirty-one. Week of three oh five. That might not be important. I don't know. What do we got here? Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Wow, that's oddly convenient. Oh, a lot of space behind the portrait. Hmm, wonder why that is. Oh. What is this thing? Hmm. It's a helmet. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Ooh, titanium. Composite communication and sensor package. Multi-phase. Photo multiplier. Yada, yada, yada. Da, 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 da. Lights. Reinforced. Got some bolts. Voice chat. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you can speak through it. Probably muffles the sound of your voice. So you can't be identified. <clears throat> can I check out the... I can. Oh! Ooh, this is cool. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Okay, so clearly I gotta go there. But I kind of want to check out the rest of the house, though. I don't want to run straight there. Hold on. I'm sure there's more. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Oh, okay. fine. I wanted to check the rest of the house. The fab Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Harry? Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Yeah, this is what I want to check. Oh! Secret keypad behind oh. the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Okay, so I need I need the code. You can't... Oh, now I can check the rest of the house. House. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Then let's Norman check everything. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. So a lot of this has to do with Harry. MJ, can you stop talking, please? All right, a lot of, <laughs> a lot of this has to do with Harry leaving. So Mayor Osborne has sealed his son Harry's room for the duration of his trip to Europe. The mayor will be keeping the key to the room in his possession. Absolutely no access to Harry's room will be granted without Mayor Osborne's express permission. So we're going to be breaking into Harry's room. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard Smells like Burgundy. rich people. All right, that just brings me back to that room. I don't want to be in there right now. Uh, we checked that. We got a couple gold things here. We got this. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. Thank you for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that tired. journal is still here. Sounds like a goodbye. Like Gotta he's like, I ain't room. ever gonna see you again. The city's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. 
There's nothing in there. Okay, so clearly he went on a trip. The way he just said that, he said the um trip. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. The photo was removed, though. Wonder what? what was there? Oh. Honestly, I didn't even notice that. I thought it was just like, hey, check out, you know, Osborne. All right, anything else? I don't want to miss anything. Mary's room, but it's locked. <laughs> I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Anything out here? Oh, 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 oh. There's something here. Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. Oh, that's right. I put Harry... I sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix I put him, him. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait. Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? He is with you, huh? A nice terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Okay, so he's sick. Yeah, alright. There you go. Kind of like in every other story. In the last movie, The Amazing Norman Spider Man 2, he was sick. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Why give me the option to rotate? There's nothing on the back, though. Now we got a picture. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. It oh, she's like pretty. Something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. There we go. I still want to check this last room, though. Anything? Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Nope. Now I feel sad. Nothing here. There is something here, though. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. Oh. There's one for school board. Don't care. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? What? This can't yeah. be for Harry, can it? Okay, so what's the disease he has again? I'm trying to remember the name. Actually, it'll probably tell me somewhere in here. Oh, that's gonna bother me. What's the name of the, of the disease? Law books. books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. What's this? Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Okay, but what's the... Alright, uh... Ooh, book. Harry's journal. I'm gonna look it up His after this. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. Leaving for Europe today, ha. Huh? Not sure how this is going to go. Dad says there's no risk, but that's dad. Dr. Michaels thinks it's more like 50-50. So, okay, I might not make it. If that happens, I bet you'll be reading this, dad. Who am I kidding? You're probably reading it anyway. Norman always has to know. So if you are reading this, dad, and if no risk at all, turns out to be another Osborne campaign promise, then do me a favor. Show this next part to Pete and MJ. Just them. Please. Thanks, dad. I, I love you. To Peter and Mary Jane Watson, guys, I'm sorry. Really sorry. If you're reading this, man, this is tough. Even in an imagined hypothetical letter to you, it's hard to be honest. Here it goes. I'm sick. Like, really sick. Doctors think it's the same thing my mom had. Neurodegeneration. Rapid onset. I've known for a while, but thought I could admit... Okay, so neurodegeneration. That's what it was. Is that what it was in Amazing Spider-Man 2? I don't remember if that's what it was in Amazing Spider-Man 2. Maybe it was, but <laughs> I didn't tell you because, well, because I didn't tell you. I was 
Wow, okay. I was worried how you'd react, and I couldn't stand to see you go through what I did with my mom. Watching her suffer, knowing I couldn't help, watching her die was worse than the dying. And that's actually very true. Um, I think for everybody. I think whenever you lose a family member, the worst part is probably watching them, like, drift away, so to speak, rather than, you know, after they're actually dead. I mean, that's still painful, too, but it is worth seeing them in pain. Uh, things got really bad recently. All those times that I was wiped out from partying or super busy. Yeah, not partying, not busy, sick. This Europe trip, well, it's a cover. I'm going in for treatment, experimental, long term. Dad's been working on it forever, promises it'll work. He hates the nickname the texts have for it, Devil's Breath. It says it makes something good seem scary, but maybe Devil's Breath is what I need. A little bit of bad to do a lot of good. Okay, Dad, time to go. Okay, yeah, so... Oh, cutscene. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Huh? Who's there? Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 gotta go, gotta go, 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 Checking it out. Go that way! No, I'm so dead. I'm so done. I'm so done for. Yep. There's no way I was getting by that. Okay, I need to. I need to be extra careful. I'm. I'm just still trying to um process what what I read. Is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Okay, so let me get you first, so I don't have to worry about this. Stand by, Control. I heard something. And... Bop! Let's go around here. I want to talk about what I read, but at the same time, I gotta freaking worry about this. Okay, so you're focused over there. You're going up there. Let's take you out. Then take you out. Okay, I don't want you to turn around. Um, let me make sure you. Crap, he turned around. Damn it. And. Gotcha! Okay. Okay. July 18. Bingo. Let me in, let me in, let me in. All right. Uh, Got to find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. I want to check everything, though. All right, let's play this. Norman Osborne, GR27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. 
That'd be nice. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's in Harry and Emily's medical records. GR27 was developed to treat them. Devil's breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. <laughs> I mean, we already confirmed that though, but yeah. I guess it's more of a like, hey, just in case you haven't caught on yet, this is what it's for. What's this? Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. I'm trying to see, is that like a no, okay. Anything else in here before I check this out? Yep, there's still more. What are these things? Oh, oh a little Easter egg. Hey! Alright, so we definitely get in Goblin soon, right? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. I had no idea they owned so much of New York. Okay, VIPs. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. So from here... Kind of makes sense, though. Yeah. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Yeah. Stable, Stable controls. Stable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michael's. Dr. Michael's went to this Oscorp building... But there's no security detail. This can't be it. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. What do you mean? Nope. That's just a Sable patrol. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable commercial buildings. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Dr. Okay. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. None of these patrols cross dock. Wow. So many records facilities. Don't think. Bravo, bravo, bravo. Oh. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Mike. Oscorp's going all in. No movement from Dr. Van Adder. No. Norman. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. And this must be the C team. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Where do these three categories overlap? Good old Alpha um, team. Trying no. to figure that out. Norman's not. No, I need Ben Adder as a d Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Where a, a records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Devil's Breath lab must have a big C. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Okay. Oscorp's going all in on the no. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum. A records facility could be perfect cover for the good old okay. Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. So here's an Oscorp building right here with the patrol route. There's one here. Good old Alpha team. One there. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. I know, I'm Good trying to- Alpha Team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big- There's GR one here. Oh. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. I can only imagine how many of you guys are yelling at me right now. <laughs> I must have scrolled past that like 20 times. I- I- Honestly, I was starting to get annoyed there too. I'm like, I, I don't it. see it lining Tenth up. Tenth Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR two Martin Lee incident. Martin Lee incident. What MJ, you and I are like in sync right now. And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. <laughs> Oh, it's Martin Lee's parents. This is nineteen eighty six. I mean, get out of there. Oh 
Martin Lee's been like that for a long time. Otto. Oh my god. Norman and Otto. They started all of this. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? A spider. No. <laughs> Yo, I would have I would have shot there. it. Oh, another stealth mission. This might be the longest MJ mission. Damn it. <laughs> Good thing you don't have a phobia. We have a breach. It's got a number on its back. You still got it on you. Pete, All right. I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. It's Keep the motor you. running. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Come here, you. Come here. Okay, apparently I'm supposed to go in here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Be careful, though. Yep. Sit down. I'd rather just take them all out. Sure could use a coffee. Not have to worry about them at all. Um. Stay alert. I think we got company. Go, 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 go. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up. Yep, I'll get him right now. Hey, you! Sit down! Hey! Boss, we got her. Uh. Oh, there you go. Uh, Pete, you here? Turn it off lights now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. At least they ain't just shooting you. I was gonna say, I'm like, what if they just shoot you? Like, they have guns. I, I think Sable will shoot you. Uh. Jump! <laughs> hey, there's Spidey. You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> I was low-key hoping Sable would just jump off and then like she'd pull some crazy shit and then I'd have to fight her. I have to fight her at some point, right? Because like the she's just been bitching me the entire game. I gotta fight her at some point. I'll probably fight her before I fight Otto. I feel like it'd be kind of disrespectful to Spidey if I didn't at least get the fighter. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick? Norman and Lee? And Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. I'm not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... You find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. Just kiss her, bro. Oh, she still got the spider on her? Oh, that's number 40, 42. I thought that was 12. They gonna make us wait till the end of the game. It's time right now. 
Okay, let me get up. Uh, let me get up at the top of this building. Actually, get that anti serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw yep. their legacies away just to spite Norman. I agree, Spidey. Okay. But Norman's on his way to get the anti serum. Better update Yuri. All right, we're going to do that afterwards. All right, I'm going to wrap up this episode here, guys. Uh, I think I've been recording for about uh, 30, 40 minutes now. It was actually it was a really long episode. That MJ mission was was uh, pretty long. Probably the longest MJ mission I think we've had so far this game, which leads me to believe it's probably going to be the last one. Uh, I expect another one of these today. I we might. Honestly, I don't even know how close we are to beating this game, to be honest. Uh, we got to be getting pretty close to the end here. If not, uh, one or two missions left. Uh, I really want to get to the DLCs, so yeah, expect another one of these probably within the next uh, four to five hours, and hopefully we can wrap this up tomorrow. And uh, yeah, guys, I guess that's I hope it. This is good news. It is. Goodbye. Oscorp just created a 